What a mess you are making. Look at these messy guys. What a mess they are making. Crazy. Done it. Done that little thing that I've been told to do. Got some uh, advice from a few uh, social media moguls. Well, not really. Someone, someone was just more like than me. Said, you got to do this. Hi, Jasmine. So the piggies are making a complete mess. Uh, we're running a little bit late, so I'm going to start filming before the reptiles are kind of set up and just see some general animals, and then we'll go and do some reptile stuff. We're just running a bit late because uh, we were out with Leo, the German Shepherd. Um, hi, Ella May. Uh, so these guys are a little bit late, and we're going to go um, get Teddy some extra water because obviously he's not being fed by mum. So he's not getting that same kind of constant um, drinking and feeding. There's one down there as well. Hello. So they are over there. And um, I'm going to see some, some randoms down here. And then we're going to go do the reptile. So look at this guy in his outside, his summer home. He's up at his Hamptons right now. Rio is outdoors. Hi, Kerry. He's loving being outdoors. Um, we tried to film us moving him from A to B, but he's a little bit aggressive, so that didn't work out. You right, Jay? Do you there in the background? <laughs> so it is absolutely baking here right now. Like this morning was a bit overcast, it was warm, but it's gone absolutely crazy hot now. Um, and that is obviously like it's nice for you to get out and about here, but. I just had a memory pop up from um, 2018. Tell me if your internet's back. Am I back? Oh, look, they're loving that. We should have a water fight. <laughs> no, because I'll cry. George! What have you done? You broke it? No, I just don't want it to explode. Loving George, look, he'll get in the water in a minute. Look at that. Love it. Oh, maybe not. No, he's hiding. He's gone in. He slams his door behind him as well. Sometimes. He'll run in there and then do a massive run out watch him. He'll come back out now. He's like a teenager, George. He goes in and slams his bedroom door. There he is. There he is. George! It's raining. Doing anything, George? Where's he going? I can't see him. He's in his box over the back. <laughs> look at his monitor. No, I'm not talking to you. Um. So yeah, absolutely. Oh, look, 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 look. He's over here. Bo and Pete and uh, the triplets are over here. So yeah, we are going to start our reptiles in a bit. We're just running a little bit behind. Um, uh, the reason we're not putting them up yet is because I don't think they're safe enough. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. So they're going to stay down here with us to keep an eye on them because it's just, they're a little bit too small. Look at Einstein. She just doesn't like people, does she? So they're over here. Bo and Peep over there. And then our piggies over here. So yeah, give us about five minutes and we will start our um, topless farmer in the background. Did you see him? Um, we will start our reptile session in a minute. Uh, so yeah, I was just saying, so I look back at um, 2018 when we had a bit of a festival here. So um, I put together a kids fest. So we had circus and dragons and dinosaurs and face painters and fairies and all these amazing things for kids to do. Music, um, everything. And it was absolutely flooded. Torrential weather the whole time. And... Um, that was my big idea to uh, boost the farm up and bring in some um, amazing income for these guys. And um, it, yeah, it just absolutely fl flooded. It was soaking wet, it rained the whole time, it was freezing, and it was Easter weekend on um, 2018. Heartbreaking just to be here and all the work that everyone put in. And obviously, no one really came, and it was drenched. Hi, Brayden. Hi. 
Do you remember Kids Fest when it was just absolutely yeah. freezing and which muddy? One where is absolutely freezing and muddy? Yeah, no, I don't get much luck with things. So uh, this is 2018, which is Easter weekend. We're about to oh. get into now. So look at the weather now. Mm. And for that one there, we had solid rain for weeks before, and it was just the whole thing was a disaster. Uh, heartbreaking. So we are going to start the reptiles in a second. We're just running a little bit behind today. Um, Je um, Je 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 What's her name? Jade. I'm saying Jess. My daughter. Jade isn't my daughter, just for the record. Um, Jade is... Um, what's he doing on the floor? Jade's gone to check on Teddy and to give him some more water. And uh, then we're going to do our reptile session. Oh, noisy. What reptiles do you want out today, Brayden? Ooh. Quite like bearded dragon. Yeah, I should get bearded dragon out. Yeah. Snakes. Um. Salem. I feel like we should put a. Uh, I mean, maybe not so many snakes. Okay. Okay. We can do bearded dragons instead. Pop over to Rio again. Can we make Rio dance? Rio, Rio, ma, 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 ma. Rio, Rio. All at the Impala are looking great. Last night I was on a run and he kept making noise. I thought it was a human. I turned around every time I'd stop, and Oscar would be like, "It's only Rio," and I'm like, "Are you sure?" It sounded like a human. I like. Well, when like, he first over. came, when he first came, his screaming was the same as um, Jessica. Like oh, when God. Jessica and Oscar get in a fight, so I used to be like, "What's happening with Jess? They fighting again?" And then Jess would be all happy, and it'd actually be Rio making all those noises. Oh, the animals looking great. I did wonder what you meant, Frida. I didn't want to say. Um, I thought it was some kind of code. I didn't understand. <laughs> All the Impala are looking great. I just read it out because I just thought that might be like their hometown. Like everyone in, you know, their towns. Like, I don't know. I can't do it. you got to hold your finger like that and then do it. Brayden's just trying to... Go on, go on, Brayden. This is better. Go on, Brayden. Why are you in a fleece? Because... Animal farm logo. Okay, cool. But it's the animal farm merch. Baking. Like, like some people that don't wear the animal farm gear. I'm in like mini cargo shorts and a vest top. <laughs> Dancing. No, she <laughs> doesn't with Jade. Everyone loves Jade the best. Don't worry. This is me. Have you seen the amount of spelling mistakes I've been making on our posts and comments? Shocking. You got all riled up last night about something, and then I just gave him strokes through there. I, was I wouldn't really, put your finger in there. I was really surprised. He's like, what? You're just, he's letting you give him a stroke on the head. Most, he, he doesn't down. like males in general. He's very aggressive to me. I wouldn't. I can't even, Hi, Amelia and Weston. I'm literally filming because I know Rio's going to bite Braden because he's... I don't know why you're doing that because he'll just... He's really moody. It's nice for me. Okay, right, well, we'll see. So Rio is enjoying his bigger outdoor space now, but it's not safe to have him out here in the winter because um, of the weather. It's just too cold, so he needs to spend most of his time in the winter indoors and... Oh, hi, Mustang, Barricade Southwest. Oh, this is the guy who's coming to our... Um, Dinosaur weekend in August. Hi Ella, watching from California. Glad you're back with us. You missed. Hello. Oh, is Teddy coming down? Let's go see Teddy. Uh, you missed our triplets. We caught uh, triplet lambs being born. Brayden's sticking his finger in with Rio. I said he's going to go missing in a minute. The Boas, Teddy and Jade. Jade's wearing leggings and jeans and a top and a fleece. And it is, it is aching. It's a big mess. Look at the mess on the floor. Make it into a big pile so these guys have got sun cream on. Come on, Brayden, put some effort in. <laughs> so, yeah, we are going to be doing the reptiles. Don't worry, I know Andrea loves it. Um, we're just a little bit behind schedule today. So I thought rather than being late online or pre-recording like last week I had to because of the internet, I will just start with some animal farm and get the reptiles out at the end. Oh, you've been watching? Oh, but thank you, Ella. I'm glad you're watching still. Really Hi, Maya from Edinburgh. Like, you can just see their skin then. It's like our skin. So yeah. I think that, like, all animals, they have loads of fur in that, but they are just us with hair and different shapes and sometimes with hooves. Is, this, is that your scientific description? It is. Braiding the science scholar just coming out. mammals specifically. Like, it's a different story for, like, um, reptiles and that. But I think Braden's um, losing the plot as well. 
Do you miss having friends, Brayden? Friends? I know, I was going to say. I know you I'm haven't actually have, had any friends yet. Hi, Alfred. Hi, Ella and Toby. So we are going to get some reptiles out in a minute. We're just a little bit behind today, so we thought we'd just have some fun with the piggies while we're waiting. Brayden, do you want to go in and go swimming in with them? Um, not in that, I'll go in. Wait, no, get on you can go in. Sorry. Take your fleece off. We all know you work here, don't worry. You got nothing on underneath? No, it's not. <laughs> Hi, Mia and Riley. You could be our farm hot stuff we've been talking about. A bit young, actually. We said we need a nice um, fitty farmer. We need some uh, a nice kind of um, something for like, you know, like Joe Wicks for the exercising. It's all girls here. We need, um, obviously we've got Morgan, who's gorgeous, obviously. Um, but we need some uh, Joe Wick style farm hands. So if you know anyone, get them to message us. Hi, Emily in Bridgewater. Hi, Isaac, watching from Burnham. Hi, Mia and Riley, in case I missed you. So many animals to care for. Do you ever sleep? Um, no, because these guys here are all like daytime troubles. But it's the other ones, well, not this one so much, that just at the minute I particularly do not want to go to bed at all so I tend to go to bed at about two which is terrible um and then drag myself awake with a bottle of Lucas Aid by the bed hi Tom from Taunton hope you're doing well hi Sally thank you so much uh, yeah I, I, it's really unhealthy I have a pack of Twix and a Lucasade multi-pack by the bed. So in the morning, it's alarm, Twix, Lucasade, drag out. Because I'm not a coffee drinker. Hello, young man. Would you like to do some reptile handling today? Maybe. Do you want to introduce yourself? I am Esther. I'm off. And you're out of breath. Oh, who's this? Wait there. Someone says, Alice Emily used to work for us I'm years ago. Well, here. Nice I can't wait to bring your children. What year were you here, Alice? A daughter's 11 months old and loves it. Hi, Kobe in Cheltenham. Let me check inside to see if, if I know any Joe Wicks, I'm keeping them for myself. <clears throat> Lost the plot eight years ago my son was born. I'll do the farm hand. Are you a fitty, Scott? Um, hi, Nikki. Miss the place. Originally from Burnham, but up north at the moment. Well, you can come and have a holiday down to like Breen area, couldn't you? And come and see us again. Oscar, show us your muscles. Oscar, they bit you when they was babies. They don't bite anymore. All babies bite. You bit me when you was a baby. So, yeah, well, if you stay tuned, we are getting the reptiles out in a second. We're just running behind a bit. Should we go see Rio again? Oh, look, we've got a chicken on their own. We'll have to find out why this one's on timeout. Maybe they're quite naughty. Scott says hi, Oscar. Oh, me, before I had Oscar. When I was young and beautiful, many years ago. <laughs> it's all gone wrong since then, Alice. Was I pregnant when you were here? A cheeky nougat. Well, you'll remember Brayden then. So Brayden would have been a little baby, and now he's, looking at him, a full-blown teenager. Full-grown. Oh, everyone loves moving down. Everyone just, Burn on Sea is just full of people that moved here from... Birmingham and Wales. I think there's more people from Birmingham and Wales than there are born here. I'd like to say I'm okay, lol. We're one of those people. Well, we haven't moved from up north. We've moved from... Um, well, you didn't move. You were born here. No, I moved no, about 11 no. years ago from the no, south-east. Um, Jay, um, Brain, are you going to help Jay get some reptiles out? Yeah. And then I'll meet you back at those benches. Right, so they're going to go get the reptiles out behind me. Baby lamb. Oh, we're in Breen watching Arthur. Wilkes really enjoying the show. Oh, Breen, just just down the road, just next to us. Well, hi, Karen. Hope you're well. I bet Breen is very peaceful. The most peaceful March. What, what, no, not in March. Most peaceful April that um, Breen has ever had in the last 40 years. So Breen is, is right next door to us and it pretty much goes from no one living there. It's a very, very small community and um, going up to like thousands of people coming here for the summer. I used to work in the kitchen. Well, you have to send me a picture and I bet your surnames because you've got two first names. 
Did you wear glasses at Alice? I'm thinking I might remember you now. We had someone actually come here. It was really funny. A girl. And I recognised her name. And she came here with the dragon. She came here as a fairy. All dressed up. Really, really glamorous. And grown, full grown girl. You know, in her 20s. And I was like, I recognise this girl's name. She liked something on our page. And it worked out. She worked here like when she was 16. And I remembered her name from like years and years before. And then she was now fully grown. And she's um, she works professionally in the... Like entertainment world, she's been on the TV and things like that. And um, I remembered, I remembered her. Hi, Jay, watching from Western. Hi, Kian. Hi, Darcy Graham. We're going to get the reptiles out next. Oh, triplets. Yeah, I'm going to have to crack on with that tonight. Hi, Yuli in Gloucestershire. Loving the walk around. Who else have we got? Yeah, I've literally spent um, all of the gap in between here trying to ring. Car insurance ran out. Well, run, run out the other day they said basically if I don't get through to them to pay by midnight I can't use the car at all you know we might need it for emergencies and I've been ringing every day so I was on hold for like two and a half hours and finally got through and managed to pay so that's what that's what I do in between videos try and juggle the children and be on hold so look he's got a bit of wet in his fur what are you up to George oh, I do recognize your name hi Alice 17 now 26 that makes me feel old I must have also been 17 and now 26 with two children. That's crazy. Hi, Jackie. What are you doing? You're getting angry, aren't you? Hi, Joy. I remember you, Joy. You are 80 something years old and you're watching on your own, I think. I remember you from before. And you said, is it okay if you join in and watch? And we said, yeah, of course it is. It's for anyone that's on their own or a bit lonely or a bit bored. I'm good at remembering. I'm literally getting flashbacks. I remember Alice now. You'll have to send a picture of you and your children and see if you've got an old picture. Any pictures you've got of being here would be amazing. See, I knew when I got a surname I'd remember. I went to Pets at Home um, a couple of months ago and I saw this girl. She kept looking at me funny. And she knew my name. She's like, Krista, was that you? And I was like, yeah. And she worked here when she was 16, but the first year when I was here, like nearly 11 years ago. And again, she was all grown up like a full woman. And it was just crazy. Right, what have we got coming out over here? Hello, guys. Oh, we've already started without me. Hello. There's me chatting away. Right, amazing. Who have we got out here today? So I, well, Oscar, you can tell me who this is. This is Pascal. Pascal. And blue tongue stink. No. Stink? A skink. You're a stink. He's a skink. And is he an aggressive animal or is he a friendly no, animal? He's friendly. And can you tell me about Think, his tongue? Uh, it's a blue tongue to try and trick um, big birds um, oh, to think that it it's is hard. poisonous. Good girl. She's a good girl, Jess. Go yeah. on, Oscar. Yeah, stop. And, and what does he eat? Um, vegetables and and fruit, I believe. And bugs? Yeah. Oh, you're just down the road in Barrow. I didn't remember that, Joy. Well, glad you're still watching. You'll have to come and visit us when we're open. Jackie loves reptiles. That's good. I so how old is too. Pascal? Do we know? Um, no, I do not know. Is he a rescue or...? He's six. He's can, six. Um, live up to 20 years. They can live up to 20 years. Look at that. Is he originally found in New Guinea? Ear hole. He's, he's and they're originally found yeah. in New Guinea. Yeah. He's the same age as Jess. He's and he's a lot better behaved. Right, I'm just going to gonna pop round to the next one for a minute. So Frida yeah. is the same age as Jade, isn't she? Yeah. <laughs> Who's this? 52. Brayden, do you want to tell me a bit about Frida? This is Frida. She's um, a tortoise, and yeah, she's really old, and she'll live to be even older than she currently is. Fifty-two. Outliving um, me. Uh, yeah, so she can live up to a hundred. And she's a Hermans. A Hermans tortoise. Hermans. So she was here before. There's only a couple of animals that have been here before I was here. So uh, Frida was Pee -wee. Pee -wee. here before me. I don't know why that. And Frida likes dandelions. And she loves dandelions. We're gonna go have a little look for some dandelions for her. Uh, this is when like. What? What's happening? He's enjoying the sun. He's basking. That, oh, is that Rex? No, that's Dino. No, Bruno. Cool, you guys look different. There's Bruno. Yes. And what is Bruno, Jess? Um, what is he? Um, Have a guess. It's a water dragon. It's not a water dragon. You're close with the second word. Um, a dragon. 
A bearded dragon. Yeah, it's got a little beard. A little beard like Mummy has. Um, and they are called bearded track. dragons to resemble a man's beard from his front. Look, look at the beards. And they wave at each other to say hi and submit. That's cute. You might see some of them waving at glass. Just saying hi. Hi, oh, I'll be so your friend. On the and what does a bearded dragon eat? <laughs> what does he eat, Jade? Or Jess, anyone? Um, he eats food. Yeah, does he eat six-year-old girls? Oh, no. What type of food does he eat, Jess? Um, food. Okay, I'm going to put it out to Oscar because he seems like he's got an answer. Go on then, Oscar. Um, bugs uh, and vegetables and fruit, I believe, and some seeds. Maybe. Oh, good boy. Sounds seeds? good. No, no seeds. No seeds. No, no seeds. Feed them reptile seeds, please. <laughs> yeah, please. If the children are giving you information, please uh, double check with your own research. Take it a grain of salt. It's because they um they're very intelligent, but um We've sometimes they just to remember, they know? feel under pressure. Well, yeah, I called Magnus. No, I, oh, I've done it again. I called McGee Magnus again today, and then I was calling Brutus Bruno. Um, yeah, we are losing the plot over here, so please take everything we say with a little bit of pinch of salt. And if you're not sure, do your own research because we have completely lost it. <laughs> it's gone. Uh, all our sanity just went weeks ago. It went basically when we could stop getting the McDonald's drive throughs the brain cells just died off because we've been relying on them for so long. Right, what else have we got, Jade? Have you got something else down there? Um, I feel like you've got something to show me. His brother. His brother. Should I come down and have a look? Right. Jess, can you keep him safe on there? No. Brayden, are you oh. helping? Yeah. I'm guessing. Uh, I'll be back in a second. Mr. Ding Stargate. And who's this over here? That is Dino. Hello, Dino. Um, he hasn't got blood on his face. That's a berry. berry a squished berry. berry. That was when he tried to eat a six-year-old girl a few minutes ago. It's a little bit left. Oh, wait, there. We've got some other names here. Hi, Charlie and Freddie. Amy used to work here as well. And they love the farm when they visited. Tonight, it's literally just the there, old please. team. Two metres, please. Can I put me, me. Oh, yeah. All right. Calm down. All right. All right. I'm moving. I'm moving. We are very professional here. Two metres. Amy and her twins. There you go. You can film them both now. Yeah, they're in together having a cuddle. Uh, put him on the grass, let him get outside for a bit. Um, Crazy isolation. run up to about 10 miles an hour, bearded dragon. Crazy. So if they got out, we wouldn't catch them, would we? No, they're, they're, they're actually the most docile out of all the lizards, but they can run to 10 mile, 10 mile an hour, but obviously not that long. To be fair, Scott, if I wasn't in this isolation, they would have locked me up by now anyway. So Wait. it's it's the only difference is I get to be outdoors uh, rather than in a cell. Wave. <laughs> Doesn't want to wave at you now. So we do the reptile handling at the farm uh, as one of the kind of like interactive sessions that we do. So every day when you come here, you can do a cuddle club with the rabbits, but you can Jess, also do reptile handling with these guys. Wash your hands, please, if you're done now. Jessica, wash your hands. She's gone off on her Thank bike you, again. Oscar, can you tell me a little bit about um, why you love reptile handling and who are your favourite reptiles to handle? Um, I like snakes. Yeah. Um, my favourite one is, uh, it's like, it begins with an S and I can never remember it. I think it's like Sam. Salem? Yeah, Salem. Salem's your favourite. The boa? Yeah. The big boa. But you also like um, Tango, yeah. the corn snake. Yeah, but... Have you ever held Stella, the Californian king snake? No, um, I won't let him. No, because she's a bit once. crazy, isn't she? <laughs> once. Yeah. What, just sneakily just broke into Jay when Jay wasn't looking? I bet Henry giving you. Hi, that. shout out to Connor Holman, who loves the videos. No problem, James. Oscar, can you say hello to Connor? So, look, this guy is loving being outdoors. So it's really important to get them outdoors when you can and let them have a little bit of nature and a, a bit of fun out here too. Look, he's burrowing down there. Um, he's a northern blue tongue skink as well. A norv a nor Another northerner? Northern. Not another northerner. We've got Meg from Leeds, Jay from Manchester. Now we've got um, Pascal, who's northern as well. I don't know if we could be doing with all this. They're very happy over there. Who are your favourite? Look at that literally cuddling, look. Titanic. They're brothers. Best, yeah, you and your brother cut all the time. Nice. Jade, who are your favourite reptiles? Pascal. Pascal. He's and why is that? Because he's cuddly. He's, he's, um, you can literally give him to any, anyone. Really easy to handle. So trustworthy. He's never bitten anyone or anything. He has bitten me. He has not. He has. But Everyone bites you, Oscar. You're well, annoying. Every animal on this farm has bit you. What do you think that says about you? <laughs> It's not their fault, is it? It's yours. No it's your bit hyper, and you give off hyper energy. Well, um, 
I've never been bitten by the king snake. Stella, yeah. Californian. We gave you a shout out, Ella, actually, in our reptile video. video. Um, Californian king snake, and I was talking about you probably find them in your shoes in the morning when you're getting ready. Don't go too close because you might scare them. Look at those guys cuddling though. They're probably having a nice little bro cuddle. A little bromance going on over here. Hey yo. They look angry. No, they look chill. They're happy. They're happy. Hi, Brayden. Who have you got? Yeah. Anyone? Uh, I've got Frida over there. Oh, yeah. Just oh, look, just some random turkeys going past. All right. Oh, what you got, Jade? Water? Dinner. Dinner. Oh, is it live? Uh, what he's actually doing there as well is he's actually blocking him from getting heat. Oh, okay. So he's protecting. No, he's actually doing the opposite. He's trying, oh. They're supposed to get heat. He's blocking him from getting the heat. Oh, so it's like, um, oh, I'm going to get more heat, which will make me stronger. Yeah. And I'll stay the alpha male. Do you want some worms? That's not nice. Oh, yes, mate. Let's add oh. some live feeding. I want a worm. Go on, Je eat one. I dare you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Go on, then. Go on, then. I'm not going to eat that. Go on, then. No, you Come are on, not going to eat that. Oh, I've got legs. Ah. Do it, Oscar. Are you going to eat it? Are you going to eat it? Ah, no. Yeah, it's a big <laughs> No, but me and Jess ate these. We went to at Bristol. Yeah, but they were dead already. And they were dried up and we ate these because apparently yeah, the future is um, eating bugs because we can't sustain the uh, fruit, vegetables and meat that we um, get through. What about you? Are you going to have some food? They can look. Let's see if we can get them eating. You can sustain with vegetables because they just grow. Oh, look at his face. Yeah, this is like Jurassic Park. You protein though, so you'd have to have some sort of nuts or something. It was like seaweed and bugs. So yeah, he's yeah, they're having sushi. Frida, you can just see the grass moving as she moves along. You can just see something is moving to the grass, but you can't see what. Oh, Frida. <laughs> Rio is like, give me attention. Go, Oscar. Go, Oscar. Eat a meal worm. Go, Oscar. Oh, no. he's eating. Everybody's oh, yes, I missed that. Can thing. I get rid of the teeth, though? I don't oh, like have it. Have a look at that. The garbage teeth. Oscar, they're saying you're a chicken. Uh, are they? Look Go on, let's eat one. Uh, uh, do I have to swallow it? Yeah. You uh, can't, like, put it through pain. I don't you think you should eat it. Oh, I don't bad think you should. Like lick worms. it, like do do what he's doing. No, they're not bad for you. It's good for you. Just lick it like he's doing. Just stick your tongue in a lip. They do have a lot of protein. <laughs> you and your son did a bush tucker trial to eat them in your local reptile shop. We did it at. Oh um, we should do a bush tucker trial. We That'd should actually. Oh, he's coming. Hello. Excuse me. Is that copyright? <laughs> what are they gonna do? Hey, I want that one. And uh, are you actually gonna do it? Don't do it. Come on, Oscar. I'll wait, give you a quid. I'll give you a quid. I don't, I don't no, eat the whole thing. I'll give you a pie. No, don't. We had three corn snakes and a king snake and a lizard. <laughs> ow, ow. It's being great. Don't do it, Oscar. Well, he's actually still living it into the wild. Try and get a bit closer. Coco's been playing with that treat ball all day. I don't think there's anything in it anymore. They reckon you should. No, Braden's a vegetarian. He won't eat that. Yeah, I would have had one at Bristol if I wasn't vegetarian. Mm, yeah, of course you would. Braden has been a vegetarian since he was younger than Jess. Um, so no, he will About not. The same age as Jess. Feels like a lifetime. But yeah, probably younger actually. He's very happy, isn't he? I dropped him! <laughs> He's accidentally no, dropped him so he can eat dropped. him. He's free now. Oh, don't eat. Don't eat them because he might have touched it. Yeah, leave it now, Oscar. Yeah, because that was a clean bowl, so that was why. You've lost your charm. Wait, can you get me another one? No. No, because no, you're not going to eat it. And... It's face. Oh, you're going back in then? Okay. Bye-bye. Oh, Come in. Jade, how's the baby water dragons doing? This one is Rex, um, I believe. Great, do you want me to go and get it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Check on Frida. Keep an eye on Pascal, though, please. Where has he gone? Oh, there he is. He's just chilling over there. Pascal's just over there, like you see. Oh, I'll whip my shoes off. Get down and dirty in the grass.
try and get a good shot. I'm the worst wiggly. Mark was going to lend me his little um, phone holder today to do some good filming, but it's disappeared. He's like, why are you watching me? You okay? So tell us about what you've... Ooh, ooh, he's going to me... Oh, going to bounce my face then. Tell me what you've got at home. Send us your pics as well. Oscar's, no, he's, Oscar's a bit of a not really, uh, Jessica will do anything. So when we went to at Bristol, at Bristol, it's not even called that now, it's called We Are Curious. So I don't know if they do the same thing there. Um, Jess was just eating everything, she didn't care. Jess never cares. Oscar's always a bit, um, a bit shy and a bit timid on things. Tell me who you want to see. I've got um, Pascal's next to me on the other side. I've got Bearded Dragon here. Really, I've got to look after him for the most because he'll run away. Get them outfits of monster trims. Get these guys on a harness, walk them around. Can you hear Coco? Where's, I've lost, wait, okay, wait there. I've lost Pascal now. There is, oh, there he is, look. Very happy. It's just chilling. I love the way Jade has left me responsible for all of these reptiles. Oh, Lizzie, I'm so sorry to hear that. What was her name? I put him off. He probably would have done, actually. But knowing him, it would have been sick. Oh, happy 90th birthday to Ella's sister who lives in Lynx. No snakes this episode, sadly. No snakes today. Hey, it's hey. got to go around their feeding schedule now, hasn't it, really? So who have we got now, Jade? Uh, this is Wanda. Wanda. I've got to be very careful with her because if she jumps out my hand, I will She's never gone. get her back. Okay, so she is a water dragon. A baby water dragon. She little. Oh. You watch that bearded dragon. Oh, Tina can do little jackets for the um, big yeah, dragons, these. I guess. Yeah, they're yeah. really good. They like like getting dressed up as well. Why? I don't know. So they we'll do some better. If it, maybe Jade, when you're indoors, if you do a little mini video or something, so we can see Wanda better. You not see her? No, she smiles well. I don't want to get too close to you. She hands. shout at me. Yeah, but you shout at me as well because <laughs> you're like, stop filming me. Look, Wanda. Uh, Gorgeous. You got blood. Because I got scabbed. And how old is Wanda? Um, six, seven, seven months now. Seven months? Are they so tiny? Know. How is she so For months? ages. Oh, and then they get so big. The male's a lot bigger than her, though. Well, then the big daddy one's huge. Over here, look, this one. Jess, Jess what are you doing? She, she found um, a kitchen. That is for the female Who's rats. this? We've got... Someone topless in the background. You grew, yeah, yeah you we got grew our farm hunt going past. I got that from the shop. No, that was my farm years ago. Yeah, I know, and I got it. You haven't seen it for how long? I've cleaned that. Come on, you can help me do it with the female rats. Yeah. What um? What do you feed the water dragons? Uh, same as beardies. Uh, same as beardies. They have a sped sometimes, but um, not too often. They just live on mealworms, baby crickets. What? What am I lying on? I thought I was lying on Frida then, but it's, a, it's just a big twig. And you've just got to always remember to gut load. Goldfish? Who said goldfish? Gut load. Gut load. <laughs> well, they're water dragons. They would eat fish as well in the water. Little tiny fish. Not Who that. else have we got on here? I've missed some comments now because I was... Um, Did they bring Little that jackets water? for them, for Spike. They can hold their breath for a long time. Very long time. <laughs> Do you think you would have eaten that if I hadn't said anything to annoy you? Um, no. No, I don't think you're like a little bit more, not a chicken, but you're a little bit more uh, reserved in life, aren't you, than like crazy Jess? He's a chicken. Jessica's brought her old kitchen over because apparently the animal's going to have it. But then she'll get an argument now and say, Jess, do you want to come see any of the lizards? You can see Pascal from the. Are you house. making them dinner? Oh, you fed yours goldfish. Oh, I'll say to Jade. Go down the uh, fun fair. 
Yeah, okay, do you go to the fun fair and then you just go like, hey. Hey, you guys. You wanna My beardies you? are going to run away. So one's here and one's made it all the way over here now. Hi, gorgeous. Um, I will have uh, mine the beardy. Can I have some chicken nuggets and some chips and a Big Mac meal? And a TJ Friday's free Frida's off. Look, Frida's out with Brayden. Don't let her eat the stones. Beardy is off. Like eats those, but it's not good for them. He's like, I'm gonna make it out of here. I'm gonna have the best night of my life ever, but then tomorrow I'm gonna come home crying. Because I've realised that actually I love my little animal farm family. Oh look, this one's having an eat now. Let's just go watch this one eat. Look, look at his belly, it's like torn. He's got his hand in his bowl. Um can I have a Fanta please? Okay. Jessie's making me dinner. It's funny because we never really get the time to chill out and have fun over here when we're actually uh, not on lockdown. We'd normally still be open, especially Easter holidays, still be very busy. I've put the little link on there, actually, if anyone does want to donate. Wow. And Jess is over there. He doesn't actually eat this grass. I've put him in it. I haven't seen him eat any of the grass. He him? Loves, he loves the clover. Oh, him? The Frida, the, the, the male, is it now? She's had a sex change over, over the course of... Uh, ask her for a glass of wine. Jess, have you got any girl beers over there? I just call them girl beers because she understands that bad. What? Do you know what wine is? All right, yeah. Oh, mom. cool. Who's this, Jade? There's the daddy. This is Daddy Rago. Oh, my goodness me. Look at him. And the only way to keep them calm, really, if you're going to hold them, put two of your fingers by its neck. Mm. Like oh, that. it's gone. It's gone. See, Andrea yeah. fed her water dragons goldfish. Yeah, you could feed them pinkies, like baby mice. Oh, so cool. Here he is. One's this size, anyway, not the, not the ones that I just Not the little diddy ones. ones. Um, so yeah, they've been about for about 20 million years, um, same as crocodiles, and they can hold their breath for up to 90 minutes under the water. That is crazy. Crocodiles have been around since, like, dinosaurs. What, 20 million years ago, I think, crocodiles. Dinosaurs went out, went out I think, 65 million years ago, though. Was croc I thought chickens was the closest relation to a dinosaur. Yeah, but crocodiles... No, to a T-Rex. Oh, 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 they're going to have a fight. But uh, yeah, chickens are close relation, but alligators and Don't crocodiles... I'm not getting your face, I'm down. Alligators and crocodiles have been around since around that time. Why, was you there? <laughs> yeah, I distinctly remember seeing my friends. Um, <laughs> Everyone always thinks Brayden's like reincarnated from like he is, he's an old man. He's just reincarnated from something clever. And they're a bit like iguanas when they I run. They're the really quick. I'll, I'll look, look at this. Wine. Thank you. We're losing some... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Are they allowed uh, to be together? <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, thank you, Jesse. Thank you so much. You pass it to me. Oh, um, which one's wait, mine? Um, I got wine and Fanta. Do you know what Mummy actually does? What? Mummy pulls them in together because she's not classy enough to drink wine on its okay, own. Sh Pour it in together and give me a cup. <laughs> Jessica's got me wine and Fanta. Right. You want to see him run? Go on then. Are you going to be able to catch him though? I ain't going to let him go. All right, go on then. Go on. He's like, no, I'm chilling. Go on. Whoa. He's off, he's off. Oh, he could go, couldn't he? Yeah, he's like an iguana, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, I'll put him on the path. Um, Pascal is gone. Pascal, come back. Well, I hope you found this reptile session better than last week's because when we pre recorded it, as much as we could get uh, indoors and see more indoors, it isn't quite as fun. Um, I've got three cups because um, oh, like there's a lot. Well, that, I'll ask that to. Well, mind the, thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much, sweetheart. Oh, I've got three cups. Mummy, Jess knows how stressed Mummy is. How come you haven't touched that kitchen for three years? As soon as I clean I've got it, you're all over three it. cups yeah, of uh, juice. Do you know what um, Brayden, you're the genius. What comes first, the chicken or the egg? Yeah, I knew it was What came first, Western. the chicken or the egg? The, chick I knew it the was chicken Western, or the chicken... Wait, do you mean the chicken or the chicken egg? As in, it depends why... Oh, God, what have you done? When you say a chicken egg, do you mean an egg that came from a chicken or an egg which, when it hatches, it will be a chicken? I uh, don't know. 
Well, you have to pick uh, one because the answer depends on that. Do you want to the film whole, Frida? The whole oh, question I'm off now. is from that ambiguity. Yeah, sorry. Frida. Frida. Yeah, yeah, I was just making sure Pascal is like not going to escape. Right. He's burying himself. That's what they do in the day. They, they live in long grass. Right. So also, it. Google says 200 million years, not 20 million years for crocodile stars, right? <sighs> oh, why don't you Google water dragons? 20 million. Yeah, I never argued you with you about water dragons. Oh, it's two, all kicking two, up here. Yeah. How many million years was it? 200 million for crocodiles, just uh, what I said. Wow, can we get a crocodile? Yeah. A crocodile. Send us in a crocodile if you've got one at home. Crocodile Dundee. <laughs> I'm missing all the comments now because everyone's just arguing here. What was I saying? I was saying something. Everyone's arguing at home. <laughs> um, I've just got loads of Jessica wine, running. so I'm fine. Oh, yeah, the chicken the or the egg question. If Wait, it's an egg that came it. from a chicken. Oh, thank you, Jess. Have you got ketchup? If by egg you mean um, an egg that oh, came from a chicken, it? then the chicken came fr first. If you mean an egg that will one day hatch into a chicken, then the egg came first. Go, girl. She can work behind the bar. She can set up a little pub while you're there. You can have a chill out with you guys. That's quite cool. Well, we are going to try and make the most of this weather, actually, because, like I said, normally when the sun's out, we're very busy at work, and the kids don't get to do anything kind of fun. So um, we're trying to actually, you know, spend time with each other as much as it's against Braden's wishes to yeah. socialise. <laughs> With his family. Rather be inside reading Game of Thrones. I forced him outdoors today. You can't run away. All right, maybe you should go so where's the other guy? Where's who else have we got? Where, go uh, where's Pascal gone? He's hiding there. You hiding sure? There. Yep. Jess, what have you got, babe? Um, here's your ketchup. It's ketchup in a cup. You know how much ketchup I like. Um, you go in there. You go in there. Okay, I'll get another cup. <laughs> no, that's perfect, Angel. It's perfect. I'm really enjoying all Jessica's cooking. She likes these three-leaf clovers. Oh, she's very happy, isn't she? Yeah, I fed her. This is fun, even though I'm just feeding her. Oh, are you it. chilling, Pascal? Do you like that? Is that fun? He's having lazy fun. Where's he gone? Let's see if we can find him. He's properly gone, isn't he? He's loving this. Bigger, bigger. Boo. Did you just sneeze? Why does she like them so much? Oh. Three cups of um, ketchup. Oh, thank you. <laughs> just set, shall, shall set me up on a little table. Yeah, use that little table there and then set me up my dinner. Yes, to be Thanks, fair, Jess. We're going to build a room for her, actually. She can stay outside every day, all day. Can I stay outside all day, every day? Yeah, turn her heating off. We'll save us money. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> can I have a little help? You can get something like that and put it up. Because yeah, that's what she usually goes, goes into. Do you know what we need to do? We need to team up with like Tesco's or Asda. They can sponsor us. You can put it here because there's loads of clovers over here. Yeah, good Teens think isolation is a punishment. No, not this one. He'd rather be on his own, wouldn't yeah, you? Definitely. Reading a Game of Thrones books after watching the TV programme. Get out and get a bike to go around. Oh, that's a good idea. Get a watermelon. Family time is precious. Make the most of it. Typical teenager. So rather a game over own family. Yeah. They're nice. Yeah, he's a bit of an indoorser. Yeah. But you have been we going out, he's been going out for brunch. Barbecue. Yes. Well, actually, I had a really good idea. So we paint um, squares on the floor, two metres by two metres with like white spray paint. And they're also two metres apart. All the whole team here sits in a square each and we all drink and play games. But then to make it more interesting, we then release trailer and pool, <laughs> but we have to stay in our own squares still. Um, so if you want to tune in for that, let us know if you think that's a good idea and we'll do that. And um, yeah, we have to stay. Oh, is he trying to escape, is what he? What about the crazy ram? That's what I'm saying. We'll oh, let yeah, Trailer we'll get him. us. Um, mind he's behind you. Trailer's at the top. No, where's the crazy ram? And see if we can stay in our own, um, our own squares. Yeah, yeah, they live together. Okay. Lockdown. Not free with us. Yeah, that's what I mean. Oh, is that what you meant? Yeah. Can I get away? Yeah, mm. she'll probably nip them. Um, do you want some water? Mine the, on the floor. Do you want some water? Yes, please. Put it on my table. Don't tread on... Uh, did you see the picture I posted of my son and the alligator? No. Post that again. Sorry if I missed that. It can be a bit manic. A bit manic. It's an absolute madhouse. Uh, but yeah, what I was just saying before is we should have teamed up like Asda's. If, if anyone's like a top dog at like a supermarket... You can sponsor us and send us all your fruit and veg you don't get through. And we'll use it for these guys. And then we'll just tattoo your logo onto ourselves. It's fine. Anything for the animals. Scott likes that idea. I came up with that idea about a week ago. 
Here are Oh, thank you, Princess. Um, Thank you. Jessica's very busy. Mm. Four alligators. That's crazy. I don't think I could cope with everyone here. I remember I freaked out when we first got snake, Anna. Do you want it to be fancy or do you want it just not fancy? Um, just not fancy. I'm, I'm chilled. So I'm going to wrap up today's reptiles. Uh, I'm going to stay out here with the kids and we're going to have um, some fun family time. Yeah, we're Brayden. We're going to have a picnic and Brayden's going to be forced to spend time with us, aren't you, Brayden? Yeah, yeah, I think you're forced to. Get some watermelon. Watermelon. Yeah, watermelon. And uh, Mummy's going to go see if there's any uh, mummy beers in the cafe. Let's get a last little zoom in on these guys. So we'll be back tomorrow at 12, checking out for lambing, see if we can get um, a foal from our pony. Living room into a massive pond, that's crazy. I'll definitely send some pics. What do you say, Is he a bit of a Joe Exotic? This guy. I need to watch the end of that tonight. Brain and I have been watching that, haven't we? Yeah. Oh, oh, he's coming, he's coming. Right, I'm going to log off now because I'm just talking a load of rubbish. Oh, who forgot? Oh wait, I've got a terrapin. Do you want to put it down? Yeah, Last uh, one then. Uh, if you touch it, oh, a bitey. Bitey, bitey. Yeah, they do bite. On How old's this one? I, uh, I'm not sure. But that one got given to us um, about five months ago. Oh. Snappy, snappy one. Yeah, you're not allowed to sell terrapins. You have to give them away, I think. Yeah, I remember. But he's got beautiful eyes. Like he's got. The when we got oh, them, up, up, I, up, I held one of the really small ones. Didn't they have really, really overgrown like claws? Yeah, you're not meant to cut um, turtles, terrapins' claws. They bleed to death. What? So you have to have they them like bleed to death grinded like, down? Uh, yeah, if you just give them something concrete, it usually grind them down. So. There you go, let me run outside for a bit. Right, I'm going to. Yeah, I said it and then I didn't I do it. <laughs> See ya. You See you tomorrow, 12 and 4. We'll go on live on Instagram in a minute, actually, because we're just bored idiots anyway. Definitely trying to come walk through enclosure somewhere and have like.